Hey guys, so today we are going to be looking at the 7th anniversary battle for the 8th anniversary, uh, or the 7th anniversary stage for the 8th anniversary battle, right? The missions are on the bottom right hand side of your screen, we need to clear both of the routes, but in this video we're only going to be doing the left, because the right is basically the same exact fight with just some different typings. Uh, it goes AGL, physical, then tech for the, uh, the Broly duo, or the, the LR gods, and then it goes int. AGL physical for the GT, uh, the Super Saiyan Force. So here's the team we're going to be rocking with to go ahead and get it done. Let's hop in. This may or may not be like the fifth time I've tried to do this. So uh, we are uh, we are having a good time, if you will. <laughs> AKA Goku and Vegeta are beating my ass. That's that's basically what I'm trying to say. I'm 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 getting these I'm catching these hands right now. Um. Getting really unlucky with situations like this, where I can't do my 18 key. <laughs> so, can't do any damage. And then I don't have a slot one unit next turn. Huzzah. I love the when RNG is everything with this stuff, man. It's great. It's actually why I play the game. I love gameplay that's RNG based. All right, only 100K. Last time I took a super in this turn, it was like 650k, so I can actually breathe a little bit, finally. <laughs> the frust the, the Dokkan recording frustrations have set in, if you will. I've, uh... <laughs> I, I start to get cranky after I've lost, like, four times, and that's about where I'm at right now, so... Uh, the, the crankiness is beginning to set in, just a tad, just a tad. Nothing too, too crazy. I'm just, I, like I said, I'm just a wee bit cranky right now. So we're gonna, but we're gonna, we're gonna regroup. We're gonna get back into this, and we're going to take him down. That's what we're gonna do because that's what the great ones do. We bring our eighth year anniversary LRs. We let them carry. We take care of business, and then that's it. So once I, like I said, uh, we'll take care of business. We'll get it done, and that's all there is to it. Because, like I've said, the great ones they find a way. That's always, that's always been my memo. And the only way to be great is to make great plays. So, <clears throat> that's what we're going to do. And the GT duo doing, like, dick for damage is not being great. But they're going to tank this pretty well. They did three supers. That's 30% damage reduction. Should be, like, 200k at the most. Or 127 Hmm, okay. I also need to remember to pop an item next turn, so... Uh, so we can get some attack up. We have seven turns, that's a lot, so... We have to win this turn, and then we have three... I believe we have three turns to get rid of Gogeta when we get out of this, because the next phase is literally just survive against them, because you only have three charges, and then they fuse. So there's really no way to get around that. Unless you could do like an exuberant amount of damage, maybe you could do like the uh, like the Super Saiyan 2 Gohan nuke strat where you do like a 100 million attack stat. But I don't know if that boss has damage reduction. I don't know. Like, I don't know what his deal is. So that is not a strategy I would recommend doing. I would recommend just kind of hanging out. What does Beetlejuice say? Me? Nothing. Just hanging around. All right. We'll do something like that because I want to have Gogeta on the rotation next time we see him. Or Vegito, rather, because he'll go blue and do like five supers and... What what is um what is Vegito uh, you know in Vegito doing nothing spoiler alert um he's just there to fill a type requirement okay there we go that normal's gonna take him out so now yeah so now we're gonna have three turns okay perfect so now this is gonna work out nicely because we have how much defense on these guys I think hmm. Let's save that. I had to think about it. So this turn is all just about survival. That's all this is. Like, just just don't die. That's, that's the rule of thumb. Don't die. Y'all ever seen that Adam Sandler movie? It's Big Daddy. It's like, he has a five-year plan. What is it? Don't die? <laughs> that, that, that's my five-year plan right now. Yeah, we do no damage in this phase. So, um... 
It's just about getting to the next one, and then I like my chances to kill any boss in this game in, in three turns, so... I've got some options. We have hella ammunition. We've got both of the five-year EZAs. We have our eight-year LRs. We've got a lot of ammunition to kind of go ahead and try to get some damage in. Maybe what we do is we get the standby with um, the GT Duo on the next turn. And that way we get lit up and then we do the standby. We do some damage from that Spirit Bomb. We throw that in and then we get more of the blue Duo. That are the blue uh, LRs, right? So that's kind of my game plan here. So long as Spirit Bomb Absorb doesn't uh, mess up the run. That's me knocking on wood on my desk. Um, we should be good if we just do that. So that's a good crit right there. Okay, we're all right. <laughs> it's like, you can't make up the timing sometime. I literally didn't even fit. I knocked on wood. That's the rule. I don't know, man. I don't know. I literally knocked on wood. You guys could hear it in the back. I went dunk, 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 and it, it is that not sacred anymore? Is that what is that what I'm to understand here, game? Like it's, <laughs> I I can't knock on wood and be safe from the effects of knocking on wood. Oh, it's not even Gogeta right now. Then what was the point of that? That's not good. My whole plan kind of just got, uh, got weaseled a little bit. Okay, no, no need to panic. Okay, good dodge. All right, nice, seven million. Hmm, I don't know what to do now. That does throw a bit of a loop in things. Because I don't think I'm going to be able to deal deal nearly enough damage to finish this guy up in one turn here. But Vegito Blue is off to a good start. I can at least say that, right? All right, so boom. Nice. All right, Gogeta. Hmm. Yeah, one turn to get rid of Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. I don't know how I feel about that. I'm assuming we have to do that phase. So, now I'm kind of confused. Alright, nice. Yeah, the blue boys showed up. They, uh, they, they want to win. Very nice, Gogeta. Very nice. That was a good display right there. That's the power of the five-year, uh, fusions right there, man. That was really, really good. So, now we're gonna have two turns for Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Assuming that the blue duo can, uh... Get their shit together here. Okay, a crit. That's a good start. All right, come on. Just crit right here, boys. And then we can do the standby on the next turn. Get the spirit bomb and let the blue boys go to work again. Nice. Okay. So now they're fusing. Fusing. Fusion, ha. Huh? Um, okay, so, yep. Then what we want to do is get this standby right here. And then, ideally, what we want to do is get a little bit of damage in with the Boo Duo, just a little bit. And then maybe some with these guys, and then we're going to get the standby. So, just don't do 400k right here. Come on, man! Like, what is that? Right away, I'm not going to be able to do enough. Depends on how much this does. Oh, yes, I can. Yes, I absolutely can. All right, so watch this. The blue boys are about to put on a show. This is going to be a master class right here, boys. I hope you're ready. All right, 15.7. <laughs> yeah, Gogeta's done. <laughs> 10.7. Uh-oh, here we go. All right. Ooh, one more. 11. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> That's how it's done right there, baby. All right, seven turns, all five types. That's how you do it. I thought for a minute we were screwed, but no. 
What did I say in this recording? What do the great ones do? They make great plays. They figure it out. And what did I do? I made great plays. I went back to the lab. I figured it out. I was patient. I didn't back out when I saw we had three turns left or whatever, the AGL phase. I kept going. And you know what the great ones did? The Rainbow Boo Duo, the Blue Boys, they found a way to get it done. That's what I'm talking about right there. That's Dokkotting at its finest. Not much, you can't do much better. Yeah, ignore that Bulma. It was for a turn mission, goddammit. I'll see you in the next one.